Oh yeah. Uh, no, it's not. Uh, for those all two of you watching this video don't know, my Captain Ginyu for real. I'm talking. I guess it's up to us, the Ginyu Force, to take care of this once and for all. Uh, let's get Piccolo. Piccolo on the J. This is definitely okay. That's what Piccolo over here. Uh, my, my username, Zeraban, actually came from Dragon Ball Z because my name is Brienne. Put an X in there and scramble it around. You can, in fact, get Zeraban, which is. Stupid half health slot, or right, whatever. It's my name, you know? It's... So I'm a big Kingdom Hearts fan. I remember, like, the first Kingdom Hearts commercial I saw. It was a kid in, like, like first grade or something. And, oh, God, they're going to talk again, alright. Hey, you. You must know about the Dragon Balls. Tell me about them. Who are you? Are you in league with that Frieza guy? You've got some nerve not calling him Master Frieza. Maybe I ought to reprimand you a bit. The Ginyu Force! Recoom! Uh, yeah. <sighs> health level drops by half. Watch the health gauge. Okay, I will. Thank you, game. That's very helpful. But yeah, blah blah, zero ban, blah blah, Kingdom Hearts. But yeah, I remember the first Kingdom Hearts game. When it came out, uh, I was like a kid in like first or first grade, I think, and um, I didn't have a PlayStation Two. I actually had a Dreamcast because that was my first system, and uh, I thought it was like the coolest commercial because it was like it was. They didn't even show you anything about the game. There were like shots of Disney characters, and then it was just like the song, and it was like simple and clean. And I was like, oh, I need that game. I was like, Mom, can I have PlayStation Two? She was like, no. And then, like, like a year later, maybe, I got a PlayStation 2, and, uh, I completely forgot about that game. So the first Kingdom Hearts game I actually played was Kingdom Hearts 2, which is a great game. I don't know why I'm talking about Kingdom Hearts. This is a Dragon Ball Z thing. Uh, <laughs> I could talk about Dragon Ball Z for days, too. Freeze just like, it is not the time. Yeah, I guess we'll just keep fighting. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with me. Help. You can't get away from me. Why would I want to get away from you, Piccolo? You're the best. You're like the king of pickles. What? That's not what his name means? His name means nothing. It's just a musical instrument. Actually, most of the Dragon Ball Z names are food puns. Like, Gohan is rice. In Japanese, uh, you know. Vegeta's like vegetable. Raditz is like, you know, radish. Oh, come on. Get up, Piccolo. Just like hit you, barely. Don't be a baby. Be a man. Or. Thing? What is Piccolo? He's not a man. His race is asexual. It's like calling a bacteria a man. He's not, well, like a virus, a man. He's like not a, well, not really viruses. They're just like genetic material. They don't have DNA themselves. But, but yeah, it's so weird. Oh, come on. This guy has like sliver of health. No, um, I, I can keep going on. Like, like Ginyu Force, you got burner and jace or like butter and juice i mean i'm not gonna list out all the food buns there are too many evil dance click click boom rage Ooh, something i don't have everyone can use rage everyone gets rage -ious. everyone gets angry sometimes but nobody should be angry all the time you hear that vegeta Okay, whatever. I'm just gonna keep going towards Frieza. I'd really like to wrap this up in a 
pleasing manner. A way that isn't too annoying to deal with. Boing 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 ba boing boing. Springy make boing boing. The heck is Dende? Can I uh how do I Oh <gasps> no! Oh jeez, why do I keep doing that? Okay. How do I uh see what's going on? R1 button, setup skills, dragon radar, L2, display status, menu, final selection on a play character, select a play character. Come on, you're not help. How do I see what's going on? I guess I don't. Okay, that sounds fair. Yeah, cool, man. See, this is why everybody hates Dragon World on Budokai 2. It sucks! I will be your opponent. Actually, that sounds like something Piccolo would say. So is he King of Pickles, or just... I guess he's King of Pickles. Well, because you have Piccolo, and then you have, like, Drum. It's like, like, the Mechians are supposed to be, like, musical instruments. Or not. What about Dende? <clears throat> Or nail. I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, come on. Get out of here. Get thee gone, bro. Let's just knock this guy out. Ugh. <laughs> I'm all complaining. Like, I don't want to play the game. This is why I can't do live. I'm doing live com right now. This is why I can't do, like, live com. Because I just drift. Oh, sweet. I knocked him into the snow. Yeah. Yeah! But, uh... Whoa, yeah. But <laughs> this is why I can't do live comm, because... I'm... I'm too stupid. I'm too much of a nerd. I mean, you think I'm nerdy? I don't know what I'm saying. You think I'm nerdy, like... I'm not, like, post com stuff. At least I usually have stuff to talk about. Like, now I'm just, like... Nerd rambling. And it will, con it will continue to be nerd rambling. Yeah, I mean, I keep on interrupting myself. I don't know. That's the way it has to be. It's the only way I know how to live. That's the onlyest thing I know how to do. Oh, come on! Really? This is another reason this board game thing sucks. You always end up fighting the same dudes, because, like, you hit them a space away, and then it's their turn, and then they just, like, come right back to fight you. It's not cool. A lot of this stuff, man. It's a bad idea. Give it a 0 out of 10. This game gets a 0 out of 10. <laughs> nah. This is a cool game. This is the first Dragon Ball Z game I owned. Actually, I should tell that story. The story on how I got this game. I was with my cousin. Well, well with my older cousin. My first cousin. Because my mom and her sisters are kind of far apart in age. And, um, so I was with my older cousin, oldest cousin, pretty much. Oldest first cousin. She's like. She's not old or anything. She's like in her 30s. And, um, I mean, obviously back then she was in her 20s. It's some, some kind of 20s. And I was maybe 9, 10 years old. And I was going on a trip with her to pick up her kids and, uh,. Because we live in Texas, but they were in, uh, North Carolina, I think. So we went on a road trip, and while we were on this road trip, while we were coming back and I had my cousin, we stopped at her friend's house in, uh, Louisiana, and I was just so obscure, but hey, whatever, there's nothing going on. And, um, and at her friend, she, and her friend, her adult friend had, uh, two, like, teenage sons, pretty much. And it was a good time, man. It was a really good time. And the coolest thing about it was... Click, click, boom. Improved nano machine. Sounds cool. Sounds cooler than what it is. And one of her sons, her oldest son, had this game. And I was like, oh, this is cool. I didn't know they made Dragon Ball Z games for PlayStation 2. And by, by then, I had had my PlayStation 2. And I was like, oh, man, I really want to play this game. 
And my mom is feeling really strict about oh they're gonna talk, hold on. So you're Frieza, huh? You're a lot more puny than I thought. I see. And you're a lot stronger than I thought. I'm a little bit surprised that there's someone in the world stronger than Captain Ginyu. But you are still no match for me. Maybe, but we don't know that yet. You've got a lot of nerve. <laughs> what? <laughs> You're no match for me. You don't know that. You've got a lot of nerve. You don't know that. Uh, but... Yeah, and back then my mom was a lot more strict on the kind of stuff she would let me play. I mean, obviously now she didn't care because I'm like an adult, but like... Back then she didn't want me playing anything with like any kind of fighting at all. Because she thought it would make me a violent person. Which, by the way, is not true. There's like no basis for that thought. Because... My mom is a lot more- she has a very short temper. I'm a very patient individual and she- she tends to get offended and upset at like the slightest of things. But uh, yeah, she wouldn't let me play anything of violence, so basically I had to- I had to kind of like sneak this game. <laughs> but uh, it's- it's a good game, you know? It was- I put a lot of hours in on this thing. But really, um, once I once I picked up Budokai 3, I never touched this game again, because Budokai 3 is just so good. Probably one of my favorite games ever. Definitely one of my favorite games ever, what am I saying? I mean, probably like, it's up there, it's up there with, uh, you know, Kingdom Hearts. And... Well, Kingdom Hearts 2, I'm not really a fan of Kingdom Hearts 1. I played 1.5 and I was like, oh, this is, uh... That was my first time playing the first game, and I was like, oh, this is, uh, this is, this is nice. <laughs> this is, I'm gonna, oh, come on, he might kill me. Oh, please, Frieza, merciful overlord Frieza, man, please. There we go. <laughs> I had to go Super Saiyan 3, but he's dead. And, um, yeah, it's up there, I like this. But yeah, I played, uh, 1.5, and that was my first time playing the first Kingdom Hearts game, and I, I thought, uh, yeah, this is... This game is up. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, this game is uh, it's pretty fun. I just thought it was the, like the coolest thing because there was so much in this game like I'd never seen. This doesn't look very good. Cause I mean, I played on the Dreamcast and like. You know, coming from the Dreamcast, which, I mean, was it was, it was a good system, but, I mean, it sounded like a printer. I, I just thought this was, like, so smooth, and the controller was so much nicer on the PlayStation 3. PlayStation 2. Yeah, I mean, the same controller, but, you know, PS2. This is what I'm playing it on. But, I, I mean, I definitely see the reason this wasn't on the Budokai HD collection. It's just a worse version of, of Budokai 3, honestly. That's what I was thinking. I was thinking Budokai 3. And there's a lot about this game that just... I mean, you know, it's a polished... This is when people had to, like... You had to release a polished game or no one was gonna buy the next one. This was when you didn't just, like, release patches- Oh god, I did it too late. But you didn't release, release patches or DLC, you know? Well, the game was what you got. But yeah, I remember there was a, a Dragon Ball Z game every year after this one, and I always- I always had it. I have, like, every DBZ game for the PlayStation 2. Except for the original Budokai. I do not own that one. But it's on the HD collection, so I don't really- Feel the need to own it on this, and probably won't ever buy it. And I played that one. I didn't like that one either. So, yeah, he's knocked out cold. <laughs> knocked out cold <laughs> in the snow. You see what I did there? Hey, cool. Freeze is dead. Let's let's uh let's leave. Let's get out of here. I can't believe I freeze was attacked and hurt by this. I don't even think the battle is over. Don't even think. Many of them are leaving for here for now. Ha! You can't get away, Frieza. I think he got away. Okay. That happened. <laughs>